Here's what a doctor will look for in your kidney function tests. These tests are used to check how well your kidney is working for signs of dehydration and kidney diseases. The test comes with these results here. Feel free to screenshot as I'm going through because we'll be moving fast. Creatinine, and no, I'm not talking about creatine. Creatinine is the byproduct of creatine found in muscles. The kidneys clear creatinine out of the body. When your creatinine is high, this is because the kidneys are not clearing creatinine properly. And this is usually because of dehydration. However, people with lots of muscle will have naturally higher creatinine levels. Urea or blood urea nitrogen. This is a compound formed in the liver as a result of protein metabolism. Urea usually goes up when the kidney is not clearing urea out properly. This is usually because of kidney disease or dehydration. Sodium, this tells us the sodium concentration in your blood. Low sodium, also known as hyponatremia, can be caused by things like excessive water intake, so you're diluting your blood, or conditions that cause fluid retention, like heart failure, cirrhosis, and a syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone. High sodium, also known as hyponatremia, can be caused by things like dehydration, so your blood is more concentrated, excessive dietary sodium intake, and kidney diseases which lead to impaired sodium excretion. It also checks for potassium, which shows the concentration of potassium inside your blood. A kidney function test is one of the most commonly performed tests in the world because it gives us very good information about your kidneys very quickly. If you're interested in getting a blood test for yourself, comment the word blood below and follow us for more content like this.